I can't sleep. I keep getting phone calls from creepy YouTubers at 3am every day. Why don't you just change your number? I tried that, but they always find a way to get my new number. Just ignore them and they go away. I tried that too, but they just keep calling and calling. I can't take it anymore. No! No! SpongeBob! There's no need to get upset. Just relax and try to get some sleep. SpongeBob? Maybe you should try listening to some calming music before you go to bed. I tried that, but it's just not working. I can't concentrate with those creepy YouTubers constantly calling me. A few moments later. Sandy, what are you talking about? I'm talking about the government, SpongeBob. They're always watching. They know every move we make. Oh yeah? I bet they don't know that green means for breakfast. Patrick, that's not what Sandy is talking about. That's right, SpongeBob. The government is always watching us. They know what we're doing, where we're going, and what we're thinking. This is ridiculous. There's no way the government can know everything about us. Oh, they know all right. They've got their ways of finding out things. You can't hide anything from them. Now, hold on a minute, Sandy. I don't like the sound of this at all. Are you sure the government is really spying on us? Buzz it up, Mr. Krabs. We need to be careful what we say because they're always watching us. A few moments later. Hey, Patrick, what do you think of Plankton's feet? I don't know. They're kind of weird. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. They're so small. What are you two idiots talking about? Plankton's feet, Squidward. What do you think of them? I don't care about Plankton's feet. Well, if you all don't mind me saying, I think they're kind of cute. What in tarnation are you all doing talking about Plankton's feet? Just discussing, Mr. Krabs. No big deal. A few moments later. Hey, Patrick, have you seen the new movie Paramount just put out? Yeah, I love it. Ah, I hit it. It was so boring. It was just so. No, Sandy, there's no need for that kind of language. What did you think of the movie, Mr. Krabs? I thought it was a load of crap. Tell us what you really think, Mr. Krabs. I thought it was a steaming pile of shit. A few moments later. I never realized how close Chum Bucket sounds to Come Bucket. Yeah. It's pretty funny. It's not funny. It's gross. I don't get it. I, me neither. But I do know that the chum bucket is losing customers because of it. What are we going to do, Mr. Krabs? I don't know, lad. But we need to think of something. Hey! I've got an idea! A few moments later... I'm telling you, Spongebob, there's no such thing as Pokemon. But Squidward, I saw one with my own eyes. You saw a what with your own eyes? A Pokemon. It was small and yellow, said Pikachu. Spongebob, been watching too much TV. There's no such thing as Pokemon. Now, if you excuse me, I have a date with a real creature. I'll just ask Sandy. She knows everything about the land. Hey, SpongeBob. What's up? Sandy, do you know if there are any laws against keeping a Pokemon as a pet? Let me check my own act real quick. Nope, doesn't look like there are any laws. That's Sandy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mm-hmm.
No problem, SpongeBob. Have fun with your new pet. A few moments later, Bikini Bottom is a buzz with nose. Sammy, have you heard? The Dutch Army is going to invade Bikini Bottom. That's what I hear, SpongeBob. I'm not sure what we're going to do about it. Maybe we could build a wall. Patrick, that's not going to work. What are you two idiots talking about? There's no such thing as the Dutch Army. Squidward, you're wrong. The Dutch Army is really in their coming ticket. This is terrible. What are we going to do? I'm not worried. I just hide in my secret lair until it's all over. A few moments later, 